Six of the strangest things ever spotted from the skies, explained by science. Strange swirls in Africa. These remarkable designs carved into the ground of South Africa were believed to be markers, with the spirals forming a map to the ancient lost city of Kalahari. Sadly, the truth is much more straightforward, they were created by local farmers, attempting to trap enough water to irrigate their crops during the dry months. The Field of Jesus Discovered by British man Zach Evans while using Google Earth, this entire field appears to display the face of Jesus, or at least, its traditional representations. Located on farmland near Puspokladini, Hungary, its origins are still a mystery, but it is likely just a simple topographical coincidence. Killer Algae This algal bloom is large enough to be seen from space. Known as a red tide, for obvious reasons, the red or brown color comes from a specific type of phytoplankton known as dinoflagellates. Red tides are normally associated with toxin production or oxygen depletion in the water, and as a result, they have a devastating effect on nearby aquatic and coastal life. A Scar in the Desert This long, strange groove carved into the Sahara Desert was first spotted by a satellite in January 2005. Analysts had various theories about the clearly man-made mark, ranging from a plane crash to possible nuclear bomb testing. In 2011, however, the cause was revealed to be much more mundane, being merely the result of a buried oil or gas pipeline. Sacrificial Stones Too uniform to be a natural occurrence, these piles of rocks located in eastern Mongolia are thought to be either a burial ground or sacrificial site. Archaeologists believe that the very large pile seen towards the right indicates that a person of immense importance was buried there, possibly even Genghis Khan himself. A giant crater With a diameter of nearly three quarters of a mile and a depth of 560 feet, the Barrington Crater in Arizona is a startling reminder that very large meteorite impacts can, and do, happen. The crater is thought to have been formed around 50,000 years ago, during the Pleistocene epoch, long after the extinction of the dinosaurs, but early enough for nearby woolly mammoths and giant ground sloths to have had a very bad day indeed. 